Division, remember guys, that's what's important about this. The division, putting something in the denominator, that's what division is basically doing. You're dividing by something, you're putting that denominator, that brings that constraint. So for instance here, look at the domain. Oh, that's all real numbers, I got that. That's easy, I like that one, cool. What about this one? Uh, oh, x plus one, so therefore you can't take the square root of a negative number. I could do x plus one is greater than or equal to zero. And then hopefully you see that x has to be greater than or equal to negative one, so therefore my domain is negative one to infinity, right? But negative one is cool, because you plug negative one in here, you get negative one plus one is zero, square root of zero is zero, right? And that's fine for a radical. But when I apply division of these two products, or these two functions, I have a problem with that. Because where am I now putting this function? In the denominator. And can the denominator be equal to 0? No. So real quick, what do I got to do to find the domain? Like I have the domain here is already restricted from negative 1 to infinity. But here, I have negative 1 being included. So now all I want to do is change it to not being included. So therefore, I just have to. You could rationalize the denominator, but rationalize the denominator, you got to be careful. That does not get rid of your restriction. I'll talk about that in a second. Um, but just because you simplified it with rationalizing the denominator doesn't mean that you still have the restriction. x still has to be greater than negative, greater than equal to negative 1 to infinity. Or yeah, yes, from negative 1 to infinity. Can you change it to a parenthesis? But yes, the, what we want to do to make this correct is just say, well, it's still going to be negative 1 to infinity, but we're just going to say negative 1 is not included anymore because it's in the denominator. Okay? But I'm going to highlight your point on the rationalizing um, coming up next. All right. Anybody have any other questions on that? 